What is up guys, it is me Epic C Drums and today I'm going to be telling you about the things that you need as a YouTuber that posts about drums. And some of the basic things are like obviously a drum set, like I have in the background right here, you can see one of the symbols. Um, a camera, a microphone, and some lighting, I guess. So yeah, that's just for the basic things that you need, but those are pretty obvious, but here are the other things that you may not have known that you need. Alright, now let's get into this video. I would recommend you have is having at least five cameras when you're trying to record a drum cover so yeah five cameras because one can be an overhead one can be a bass drum type of thing and the other thing can just be around the drum set that way you can switch povs and other people can see how you're playing the drum sets on different kind of point of views so yeah i'd recommend you have at least five and that's just how i would set them up you can set them up however you want that is up to you but that's what I would do. So yeah, I would recommend you have at least five cameras when you're trying to do a drum cover or when you're trying to do a regular video like me. But I don't have five cameras. I only have one. So I'm using this one that's right in front of me right now. Another thing I'd recommend you have is some type of ear protective gear. Because trust me, you're really going to need it because drums can be pretty loud. Especially if you have them hooked up to a amplifier or amp, if you want to call it that. I personally call it an amp. But if you have it hooked up to that, it really depends on how loud you want them. But, you know, I have them pretty loud. So I would recommend you have something that will protect your ears. Because these are actually pretty cool. I got these for Christmas. They have these things right here so that it doesn't hurt my scalp or whatever. You can call it hair. Um, so, yeah. I would recommend you have some type of headphones or earplugs to use when you're drumming. Because in my a lot of my short videos, you'll see me wearing these. So yeah, that's another thing I would recommend you have. I cannot stress this enough. One other thing that you would really need is a type of big secluded space that you can use mainly for drumming. Because my drums are in my room and they take up a lot of space. So I don't really have a lot of room to put things in here. So I would recommend that you use like a garage or... I guess a basement if you have that or a really big attic because i don't have an attic so yeah. so yeah i would recommend that you have a big type of space that you could use so yeah that's one of the things that i really can't stress enough that you really need i thing i'm going to recommend to you guys is that you have an app that you can edit your videos on for example i use CapCut. i think that's my most recent video yeah that one yeah that one so I'll recommend you have an app like iMovie or CapClick because they're free and they allow you to put a bunch of things on your videos that normally other apps would have you pay for, you know, those kind of effects. And um, yeah, so I really recommend you have um, like iMovie or CapCut or you can use any other type of app that you want that is up to you. But this is the app that I use and I'm going to edit this video right here with. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys next time, which won't be too long from this video, I promise. Alright, peace out guys.